Kong Pops Quilt Shop Studio. Today we have a feast for your eyes. Let me tell you, <laughs> we are making a pizza quilt and we're trapuntoing our pepperoni. You heard it here, folks. Trapunto pepperoni. We have this beautiful um, blanket that was given to Pop for Christmas. It is a big pepperoni pizza. It is 60 <laughs> inches in diameter and it looks so real. So we're quilting it up. We have put, I, I didn't stitch this down so you can see it. I put batting, extra batting around where the pepperonis are on the blanket itself. And now I'm just gonna, that's trapuntoing. And now I'm just gonna kind of quilt around it. Kind of trying to follow the cheesy bits as we go along, okay? So come with me, adventure. So we can come down all the way here. I have it off the belt so it's all loosey-goosey. I have washed this blanket uh, and it's, it didn't shrink. So we're making a pizza quilt, people. We're making a pizza quilt. Okay, and just, just put it on stitches per inch. Doo, doo, doo. Okay, we're gonna do a base. Ooh, kind of wandered away there. So this is 6.5 that I'm gonna start off with, but then when I'm stitching around the inside of the quilt, I'm gonna use a 12, okay? So right now I'm just gonna stitch, base stitch around on the surged core edge, because it's just a circle, right? I'm gonna try and take my time, because it's just to keep her Keep her steady and straight. I have franken battinged my batting for my inside. Just try, oops, go back here. Try it so I don't stitch over my finger. <laughs> we don't want that. <laughs> So Pop says the blanket is warm as it is, but it was Munchkin who had the great idea of making it a pizza quilt. And I'm like, yes, and we could trapunto the pepperoni. <laughs> so we're all over that. Hope you're having a great day today. And we are gonna do the binding on a bias cut and we're gonna do it as uh, Friday's um, weekend project video. Okay, so come, come learn, bias cut. And we'll finish up this beautiful quilt. This doesn't have to be perfect. It's all going to get hidden in the binding, right? And what I don't like, I can pick out. Okay, so now we're at all the way over to the other side. I can kind of start coming in and start wanting to do some quilting here. So I am going to up my stitches to at least 12, if not 13. Okay, and it, like I said, it's free off the belts. I have a greeny thread in the bottom and a yellow, I think it's called buttercup on top. Okay. And we're just going to kind of pull around the cheesy goodness. And then when it comes to the pepperoni, because I have that batting already, I kind of want to ride the foot just around it. So we're going to only be able to get like in around one here because I can't get down to the other one. So I'm going to roll it. Okay, so kind of letting that foot right up against the batting to outline this yummy pepperoni. And you see here, you see these stitches right here? These ones right here? They're not gonna stay. I just did that so the batting would stay on for the pepperoni part itself. And then when we come in and do some quilting, like I'm gonna come on and do around here for that cheesy bit, it's gonna keep it all together. So I'm just keeping it, the batting there for the first time. That's why it's just got a loose, you know, not even a fancy stitch on it. It's, and it's gonna come, I'm gonna rip it right out. I'm gonna come around here again. I'm gonna follow that cheesy bit. Team cheese! And it's just gonna add so much texture to the quilt. Okay, so we're gonna go scoot up here and do here. Give it a little, don't really need that in the way. Travel to the next pepperoni. <laughs> I love this. Quilting me a pizza, Mama Mia. Got me a pizza. Okay. okay let's get back over here. Come up here. Oh, 
Oh my gosh, it looks so good to eat. Yeah. All right, no more cheesy bits. Make our way around to the next one. This is where you're letting the artwork on the quilt inspire you, right? We'll come in here to the cheesy bit. Okay, here. Remember where it's all the white little thread. I'm just gonna end up ripping it out. So I've already ripped out some of it when it was joining from pepperoni to pepperoni. Now who wouldn't want to tuck into this pizza pizza? Or big pizza pizza. <laughs> some cheesy bits. Make our way to the next pepperoni. We have um, looked at the website where Munchkin picked up this up for from Pop. It is they've got some really cool other designs. They've got a um, ham and pineapple a donut, uh, a burrito, which is just a tortilla, but you wrap yourself up in it and you can look like a burrito. <laughs> Who wouldn't want to look like a burrito? Okay, now let's, let's go up here. With all this cheesy goodness. Forget to like, subscribe, and ding the bell for notifications. Don't want to miss a thing here. No, you don't. Oops. Okay. So you guess you can call this a pizza meander. Because <laughs> we're working our way around the pizza. <laughs> a little pepperoni there, or maybe it's just a little piece of cheese. Who knows? Oh, 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 we had to finish off around the pizza. There we go. Oh, oh. So this is, uh, like I said, um, Munchkin bought this for, for, for Pop um, uh, for Christmas. I'm just going to kind of start off over on the other side here. And, uh, and I've lost my snips. I have no idea where I put them. I hate that. <laughs> I hate it when you lose stuff. Um, and it was just so cool. And then when he took it with him to um, Ontario, he said it was really surprisingly really warm. So... Um, I was, I'm so happy to hear that. And then it was like, well, maybe we should start and quilt it up, right? Yeah, it was Munchkin's great idea. And it'll be just like a yellow binding to try and play with the crust part, I guess. I don't actually have the, the crusty color for the binding, but we'll do, we'll do, we'll do, we'll, do, we'll be fine. It'll look fine, but definitely a biased one because of um, of the curvature. The, it's, a, it's a big circle, right? Okay. 
Okay, now it's pop. Mm, I don't think you can get anywhere else without rolling. So here, let me just pop the needle down a smidge, and then we'll roll the quilt just a little bit so we can get our make our. Oh, I'm loving how that pepperoni, that pop or pepperoni, pepperoni is popping out. There we go. Oh my goodness, so cute. I'm not hungry for pizza now. I certainly will be later. <laughs> okay, then we're gonna kind of try and work our way down in here. Okay. sure those that batting in the center is going to stay there right so we do want to make sure we're coming in on every pepperoni and at least doing a couple little cheesy bits Pizza lover in the house? <laughs> it's a great gift. I'm going to try and space it out as even as possible. So there's no like bigger gaps or lumpy bumps or anything like that in between the pepperoni slices. very fun and relaxing to take like a panel and then just stitch around things to learn to learn how to highlight to use your machine and how your hand eye coordination come together let's just take like a little sample part and then just kind of highlight all the things you kind of want to hide out around it it could be a garden it could be a house it could be you know an animal Mm, gooey quilts. <laughs> Stitch and cheese. <laughs> Never thought I'd say that. Stitch and cheese. Uh, I don't think we're going to make it around there. Nope, that's okay. I'm going to come back here. Be able to get the other parts there. Okay, I think. Oh, I'm gonna move over to the other side. Okay, so we can lock some stitches in here. 
I have no idea what I did with my snips. I'm so irritated right now. <laughs> Misplace something and then you just like ah. So cute. Love it. And now I'm hungry for pizza. Are you hungry for pizza too? I'm hungry for pizza. Pizza for me and you. Yummy, yummy, yummy pizza. With some ooey gooey cheese. Yummy, yummy, yummy pizza. Maybe just for me and not you. No, I'm kidding. I would share. I would share. You know I would share. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Okay, we'll leave it there. I'll pop my needle down. And I'm just going to keep plugging away at this uh, beautiful, fun project. So I hope you have a fantastic day. Enjoy the pizza <laughs> and the Sophie toy. <laughs> you want to show them your toy? <laughs> um, you guys have a great day and we will see you on the next one. And make sure you check out the Friday video where we're going to finish off this a beautiful Trapunto pepperoni quilted pizza. <laughs> Take care. Big hugs to you. Oh my God. You got the turn from over, Kasha. <laughs>